Wow, what a weekend we had. I got to tell you guys, we went to Friday's 4x4 on Saturday, and on Sunday was a good time's 4x4s. I posted one video of each here so far on YouTube, but guys, you got to stay tuned. That was just the beginning of it. Uh, they had a hellacious sand drag go on, uh, a lot of nice cars, I mean, trucks. There was one uh, Subaru there, all-wheel drive, that did drag with trucks. So you guys stay tuned for them videos. Tom Ryan was there. Corey Robinson, his stepdaughter, was there. And uh, Corey's brother. So Terry Ziegler was there. There's just so many vehicles. That was a nice turnout, I thought, at Good Times 4x4s. Seeing the Barnyard Boggers were in the house. And um, seeing a few Friday 4x4 members there. It's great to see you guys there. Friday's 4x4 event was a bomb. Man, we had a great time there. Brian from Friday's uh, landowner there put us on an island there, uh, kept us away from everybody, so you guys got all a lot of good action. So, like I say, 108 cuts from Friday's 4x4s, 102 cuts from Good Times 4x4s. Guys, we got some mud to post, so stay tuned because we got some good stuff to show you the rest of the week. The stuff that don't get post, posted here soon because there's going to be more events coming up. I've still got Spencer Speedways, Pogs Hole Hill Climb. I've got a lot of footage, stuff, stuff that just doesn't get posted right away, guys. In the winter months, we'll have tons of footage, footage to post for you guys. So, I mean, what doesn't get posted will get posted, I promise you. Again, to all the drivers, clubs, stuff like that. And any of you guys that want any photos, DVDs, stuff like that, get in touch with me. Uh, again, everything's free to you guys. So, um, rock on, guys. Thanks for having me and Ida. The Mud Mama there at your event. The Mud Mama will have videos too, not just me. So make sure you go to her channel and check her out. Bud14589 was there here on YouTube. Um, his son was doing videos for him. I'm sure he's going to have videos of good times 4x4s. Guys, like I say, I just can't say it enough. Don't miss out. A lot of good action coming up. And we're looking for your rate and your comment and checking out our ads uh, while you guys are checking out the videos. Thanks again. Talk to you all soon. It's a truck here for sale. With the event while we we're at Good Times. It's asking $1,200 as is. Thought I'd show it to you guys while we we're here. I had it on Good Times video. If you guys want to contact them or anything, get a hold of me. I can hook you up with them. Oh, nice no, tilt front on. Four tech motor. Dummy block. That's all it is. You guys heard it? Like I say, if you guys want to contact him, get a hold of me, I'll send you up with his, his phone number. It's a project in the working. For somebody to finish it up and get on the circuit with these guys. So there's a lot of you guys that always ask me, do I know where there's trucks or trucks for sale? Here's one. So I thought I'd make a video of it real quick while you guys were here. Girl lost her ring in the porta potty and she's digging for it with uh, some trash bags on her hands. There's some shit diggers. Yeah. Over there, he's videotaping. <laughs> <laughs>
Our truck didn't make it. Uh, our goal was to hopefully get it to Friday's 4x4 this last event and good times. Um, I got everything back together on it. And as you guys can look and see, my right front tire is a lot, turned more than my left tire. Well, it's not just in the adjustment, guys. Um, I am going to take a little bit off there, but look at that ball joint. Look at how cocked over to the right it is. You see it? It's ready to pull right out of that socket. So, um, Ida's uh, daughter-in-law, she works at one of the auto parts store here. Um, I could have got them somewhere else. They were like 38 bucks a piece for the ends. Um, she got them for me for 18 bucks a piece. So I'd rather wait five days to get the ends for 18 bucks a piece instead of 38 because money ain't all that right. Plus, I'm still paying for these parts for, uh, to Harold. So um, trying to do a, everything at once. And hell, I still owe Lloyd for tickets for the Trucks Gone Wild show, to be honest with you all. So money just ain't right just right now. Also, we ordered up uh, after I seen the front end shaking quite a bit. I uh, jacked it up, and you can take the whole tire, and I just wobble it back and forth this way, too. So, as you guys remember at the Trucks Gone Wild show, I lost my right rear axle. After we got it home and fixed it, I lost my left rear axle. I'll be damned if I'm going to go to Friday's 4x4, Good Times 4x4, and lose something in the front. So, we ordered all new parts. Um, going to redo the shocks and stuff, hopefully all this week. And we got two weeks for September 12th. That's the bog and grog. Guys, don't miss out on that. Um, I got to check the dates on Friday's 4x4s. I'm sure they're having another one here um, this year out at Brian's place. Good times 4x4 is September 26th. For you guys that are around here, don't miss out. Uh, Pooper 7X, get your butt down there. You're not far from there. So you can bring your Amigo down there and do some drag hill climbs and maybe dip it in the old mud bog. But uh, anyways, we're going to hopefully help him out, try to get his vehicle around this year too. Uh, for the rest of the year and we're going to see if we can get the, our trailer and stuff ready um, all this week and a truck so we can uh, participate in the rest of the events this year. So stay tuned again for a lot of great videos and we'll talk to you all soon. There's your update on why our truck didn't make it. Hey honey, I'm not laughing.